in this video we are going to see how we can create the private and public list using the option given in the main interface but before that you need to enter the user id and password to get this interface you just click on private public list and as soon as you press on this private public list you will get the the uh, uh, main page where you can define the list actually there are two type of list here one is the your list that is the private list and the another one is the public list which is for the public so first one uh, we will discuss about the private list and after that we will discuss about the public list so to create the list you need to create the uh, list of name first for example i'll just click on new list so it will display the information where you need to enter the value for example i am just going to create the list nitr library this is the private list and the sorting this list is by title author or copyright or call number so definitely by title what will be the category of this list private or public then what should be the what will be the permission here you can restrict it do not allow anyone else to add entry means anyone cannot add any entry to this particular list if you allow here it means anyone whoever sees this list can add the entry into it allow anyone to remove his own contributed entries if anyone has contributed entries in this can remove the entry do not allow anyone to remove other contributed entries you are not allowing any one to remove other contributed entries by anyone so we can set the permission accordingly right side you can see the description is also given a private list is managed by you and can be seen only by you it means no one can else uh, can see the list which you have created created in the type category private whereas in public list anyone can see but it will be managed only by you and finally save it once it is saved you can go back and click on your list so you will observe your name of the list is created now we have created the list now we need to add some item to this list suppose i am going to add the item to this particular list click on this to add list you need to enter simply the barcode you don't have to you need to enter only the barcode number or accession number of the uh, uh, book so it will keep adding to the record means this list whatever the accession number you provide here it will add the the information to this list so in this way we, we can create the list and we can add the uh, information in this keep adding so as many as entry you want you can just add to this list okay there are some options which are given here uh, we will be discussing about these options later when we discuss how we can merge the selected record or how we can do other things now we will move to the next list that is the public list now i am going to create another list that is the public list uh, this is the public list for example i am just uh, creating one list new arrival the list name will be new arrival and it will do the sorting by title category type is public anyone can see as per the description given here and the permission is do not allow anyone to add entries yes no should no one should allow except the administrator allow anyone to remove his own contributed entry yes 
if anyone has contributed in this entry it is allowed to him to remove the entries do not allow anyone to remove other contributed entries and save it so you will observe that one category or one list will be means added or has been created with the name new arrival in the public list the same way what we did in the private list you can add the information in this list also so you can see the information is getting added to this list as soon as you are pressing the means entering the barcode and adding it so no item with this barcode is found so we have added two uh, titles in this list for example you want to see this list you need to go to the catalog online public access catalog and you have to see see there is an option private list if you click on this you will notice that there are two lists here which you can see by clicking on NITR library which we created and you can see five items are there so you can see the total number of titles given here are displayed you can download this list or you can send this list through mail or you can print list you can edit list or you can delete list but this privilege is given only to the creator it means administrator or whoever creates the pri private list now moving to the public list which we created with uh, name new arrival if you click on this it is displayed and it is showing two items are in this list if you click over the new arrival it will display the title in this accordingly what we discuss in the private list the same thing you can do here also you can select it you can place hold or you can remove from list you can edit it you can print it you can send it you can download it or you can generate the new list so this way we can use the private and public list the important feature of these there are many other features when we discuss about other things we will be discussing in detail about the uh, uh, private and public list how it can be used in different way later